So, I hope you are having a beautiful, beautiful Tuesday. I just got back home. I am warm. I'm hungry. So, I'm going to go in and get a shower because I've been in my garden all morning. But I did leave out. I had to go pick up a couple things, y'all. This is a papaya tree. I got a new papaya tree, y'all. I got another curry leaf tree there's my baby there but this is a new one i got some orange and orange mint that's who she is orange mint <laughs> but listen guys i i want of course you all seen my arapicas i see everybody sharing their arapicas i got arapicas i got them right there <laughs> yeah <laughs> but anyway guys i hope you're having a wonderful day so I want to share what I'm doing over here in my garden today. All right, let's get on with the video. Yeah. yeah. So this is my uh, basil that I dropped with you all. Mm -hmm. That's it. And as you see, they're coming up. So this is my two plants, well, and this is my Arapica coffee plants. This is both of them. Now I've been having my Arapicas for, this is my second um, year with uh, my Arapicas. Now I did have a bigger um, plant, but she died last fall. Yeah. So these are the babies of that big plant and I have replanted them in these pots but they're doing really good they're sitting under my plantain trees and this is where they thrive yep this is where they thrive yeah. all right guys so these are the seeds I'm going to direct sow today. Yeah, I'm gonna drop some of these in my little planters alongside my grow bags. And this is some uh, red giant, some Shikosha beets, some more colorful five color Swiss shard. And I'm gonna drop some kind of that carrots now I have some things set out in in one of my uh, raised beds about how um, I'm thinking I want to put these plants in the beginning of this fall season do you have a picture in your head like this scene here you see here um, the sore in me kind of visualize how my plants are going to grow. I can visualize how big my plants are going to be. And it's just another way for you to think when you are dropping your uh, seeds or your seedlings is to remember is that what you see here will not be what you see in a couple of months. Uh, they're going to be big and you will probably don't see uh, a lot of soil <laughs> because the plants are going to be huge 
So the sore in me kind of visualized, um, it kind of visualized my, uh, my garden in the future. It visualized it in another month, or two months, three months. How will it look? How will it be looking? How will it be growing? So that's the, the sore in me. I want to uh, visualize it, um, how it looks in the future, right? Um, now, we all know at the end of the day, you know, that's, you know, uh, that's the gratification is to get a harvest. And I understand that. But this is what... I was always taught is and I think Crystal from Whole New Perspective put up a post in her community post today uh, speaking upon this and it's it's like don't hurry your tomorrow and you miss out on today right it's like uh, one of the things my grandmama used to tell me she says you know um, many times we, 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 you know, we want to see ourselves in the future. We want to, we want to see us when we are successful. And, and that word, I can't wait till I get this. Or I can't wait till, till I get this new job until you, you miss out on today. Right. And really tomorrow or that new job may never come but what is here today and what you see is today being present in t in today uh, is so much special to me than worrying about and getting hyped about tomorrow which I may never see so I'm gonna drop this in one of my little boxes. This is that butter crunch lettuce. I'm gonna drop this and this, yeah. Now I, I've never grown this variety. So she looks interesting. So we are gonna do it today. I'm gonna drop some of these giant and definitely some of these babies. Yep, today, y'all. Oh, this one. This is another one I will drop today. I had a great, great harvest of Brussels sprout last uh, last fall. I only grew two plants, but I harvest so many, and they were delicious. Just seasoned and roasted in my air fryer. Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! They were really good. So. We gonna do it again, do it again, yes. <laughs> All right, guys. All right, so the first one I'm gonna drop, let me see, can I get it? <laughs> Is this butter crunch. And I'm gonna drop it right in here. All right, guys. Now I'm just gonna rake over them. Yeah. It's a beautiful morning. It's not too hot. It's about mm, 7 30, 8 o'clock right now. And um, it's nice. This is one of my pepper plants, and yeah, she's doing really good. I've harvested a lot of peppers, and I'm thinking this is Shishito's. Oh, that's what this is, Shishito's. <laughs> they doing good. But anyway, that is my Butter Crunch. Butter Crunch. 
All right, I want to drop these on the other side. Let's go do it. All right, so this one is the Dazzling Blue. Now, all of these seeds are from Botanical Interest, of course. So. Now, I do have an order uh, from Baker Creek. It should be arriving very soon. And when it do, I will share. I will share my Baker Creek order. Um, yeah, y'all, I order. <laughs> my thing for when I order seeds, it's always in the wee hours of the morning, you know. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> like, 3 o'clock in the morning is when I get up and I go on all of these wonderful sites, you know. Yeah. That's my time. <laughs> The next one, yeah, that's endive. <laughs> it's endive, and I'm gonna drop it in this little container right here on the end. And we'll see what they do. So, you all know who that is, right? Yeah, that's a moringa. A moringa. Miss Moringa Olivera. But anyway, that's, um, that's one of the seeds I dropped. I'm gonna plant her right here at the end of the bed. Also right there, which I'm gonna put her in a pot all by herself. That is a four o'clock. How she got in there, I don't know, but that's okay. I'm gonna keep her. <laughs> yeah. All right, guys, so. We're gonna plant the other ones out in a bit. So Ben is on the other side of the garden and he's cutting grass right now. But I wanna share with you all what seeds I'm gonna to drop today, right? And that is uh, some more Texoy. Um, <laughs> Southern mustards. Um, I'm gonna drop some of these. Oh yeah, they were amazing. And of course, <laughs> the broccoli romanesco. Yes, I will do it again. I'm going to drop more carrots, more spinach, and lots of lots of leeks, onions, and garlic. So this is one. Uh, I'm going to drop these steamers. I haven't, I dropped some in the, in the spring, but I did not see one. So we're going to do it in the fall. We'll see what happens. This is another endive. And yeah, this is the one I grew before. I will grow it again. Right. Here's some pink Chinese celery. I will drop her. This is a huge leek. I will drop more of those. Arugula. Yes, yes, yes. I'm going to drop this also in a bed with one of the lettuce that I dropped already this morning. I'm going to mix it. Mm -hmm. And these are just some onions I'm going to drop in and around all of my raised beds. Now I'm going to, well, Ben is going to prepare uh, another 100 gallon grow bag for me. I'll share it um, in tomorrow's video or the next video. Also, I'm gonna drop some broccoli rabe and lots and lots of bachelor buttons. Some lacinato kale, some more of this sweet kale I love and Calaboose cabbage. I have the green as well as the purple, and I'm gonna drop them both today.
So this is my um, turmeric in one of my little grow beans. But look at this. I'm going to have to cover her up. <laughs> Girl, your slip is showing. Mm -hmm. well, this is uh, my corn and my sorrow back here. Got Jamaican sorrow down here in this bucket. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, there she is. That's her. More. Fun. And of course, I go back. I need to finish. <laughs> yeah. Alright guys, I hope you all enjoyed the video. Later y'all.